All right, we're here for our very first challenge for a CERT XP with the brothers Brian and Devin Knight. We're gonna get right into it with some CERT XP questions from the PL900 exam. Okay, let's get right into it. All right, so you get the question right, the other brother gets a book, you get it wrong, it's on you. Here we go, boys. First question, which power platform component should you use to create a workflow to process? Oh, Brian came in early. Devin, you get to answer the question. Power Automate. Power Automate is correct. <laughs> Brian gets the first book. Here we go, Brian. There's one. Second question, which power platform component allows the addition of AI capabilities to workflows and power apps? <laughs> That's Devin again. AI Builder. AI Builder is correct. <laughs> Uh-oh, Brian. Here we go. All right, third question. Which power platform component allows you to design insightful data visualizations? Oh, Ooh, Brian power got that. BI. Power BI hey. is right. I like it, Brian. Okay, Devin. Oh, that's a little one. You're all right. Here we go. <laughs> um, which power platform component allows you to create custom apps that, is, that address specific business needs? That's power Brian. apps. Oh, power apps it is, Brian. Very good. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I almost got him there. All right, the next one. Which component allows you to create AI power chatbots? That's Devin. Copilot Studio. Copilot Studio, absolutely. Here we are, Brian. It's getting heavier by the minute. <laughs> All right, a company hosts conferences and wants to enable customers to see the conferences that are hosted by the company. Which component should be used? Devin. <gasps> Power Pages? Power Pages. Yeah. Uh oh, Brian, it is getting rough. I can see you wiggling. <laughs> Here we go. Uh, field Text need mobile app to capture location of image of defective products. What do they use? Right. Canvas Power App. A Canvas App oh. specifically. Very good, Brian. And here we go. If a customer is traveling with a person under the age of 18, a field must display to collect data for that person only. What should you recommend? A business rule. A business rule oh, is hey. right. Oh, oh my, Brian's making a comeback. Here. All right. All Just right. Give me some more Power BI. <laughs> uh, what is the name of a Power BI visual that allows report consumers to ask questions about their data? Oh, Devin. Q&A. Q&A. I threw a bone for you there, Devin. Here we go. <laughs> yeah, for sure. oh, no. <laughs> Here we go. All right. In a star schema, which table type contains numeric measure columns? Oh, Fact table. Fact table. <laughs> here we go. It's getting closer. Oh. And here we go. In Copilot Studio, what component is used to train the bot to understand how someone might ask for a topic? Oh. Three, two, one. Oh, we both got <laughs> trigger <laughs> phrases. Oh, I should have known that. I should have known that. Oh, no. Brian, here we go. It's about to tip. Uh, in a Canvas app, which controls allows users to modify values for each column of a row in a table? Oh. I've lost track. <laughs> one more time. Three, two, uh, one. And edit form. Oh, I wouldn't have oh. got that right. And <laughs> there we are. Let's see. Can Brian hold on for the last one? No, Brian and can't. Oh. <laughs> Devin is our winner of our very first edition. We study CERTXP a little bit more. We'll get more questions right.